It's very easy to divide by 10, 100 and 1000. Method is very simple. Count the zeros in 10, 100 and 1000. Like in 10 we have 1 zero, 100 we have 2 zeros, 1000 we have 3 zeros and so on. Then start from the right to left of the number you want to divide. Count that many digits and put the point. Like in this example, 20 divided by 10. In 10 we have 1 zero. So we will start counting the digit from right to left. One time we'll count one digit and then put the point. So our answer is 2.0 or 2. Let's understand this with few examples. 3000 divided by 10. 1 zero. So count one digit. Put the point. Answer is 300. 3000 divided by 100. Two zeros. Count two digits. Put the point. Answer is 30. 3000 divided by 1000. One, two, three. Three zeros. So count three digits. One, two, three. And then put the point. Answer is three. Let me explain this by one more example. 450 divided by 10. One digit, so count one zero, so count one digit, put the point. The answer is 45. 450 divided by 100. Two zeros, so count two digits. Put the point. The answer is 4.50. 450 divided by 1000. In 1000, we have three zeros. So count three digits. One, two, three. And put the point. The answer is 0 0.4. Five zero. When our answer is like this, 4.50, then the number left to the point is quotient and the number right to the point is remainder. So it's basically quotient, point, remainder. And if we have only zero after the point, it means we have no remainder. Let me give you one more example. 37 divided by 10. One zero, so count one digit, put the point. The answer is 3.7. 3 is your quotient, 7 is the remainder. 37 divided by 100, two zeros, so count two digits, put the point, answer is 0 0.37. You can't just write 0.37, you must write something before point. If there is no whole number, then you must write 0, 0 0.37. So here, quotient is 0 and remainder is 37. 37 divided by 1000. We have three zeros, so we need to count three digits. One, two. Oops, there is no more digits left. So first you have to convert 37, which is a two digit number, to a three digit number. How will we convert it or change it 37? Just simply by putting a zero in the front of 37. So now it is 037. We have changed 37 to 037 because here we have three. 
zeros in thousand so now we have three digits here and now we can put the point so our answer is 0 0.037 this is your quotient and this is the remainder hope you understand it very well in our next video we will learn how to divide a number by a two digit number